This is Mike. He is your typical teenage boy. I'm going to use him to show you a few things about one of the most important parts of your body. No, not that. Your spine. You probably all know where your spine is located. It is one of the most important mechanisms in your body, as it supports everything else and allows you to move and bend. Your brain sits on the top of your spine, and nerves run from your brain to all parts of your body. These nerves provide a highway for sensations and mobility. For example, when we burn a finger, a sensory message is transmitted to our spinal cord, and a reflex message is sent to our arm muscles to jerk that finger away. If there were no nerves in our arm, we would not feel the pain. We would have to rely on our eyes to see the fire, or our nose to smell the fire. Nerves are delicate. Unlike bones and skin, they have almost no way to regrow if they are injured. Your spine is a bony tube that protects them. If your spine was a solid tube, it would be very strong, but you would not be able to twist, turn or bend over. So it is made from a chain of short bony tubes with soft discs between to make it flexible. These soft discs mean that it can easily be injured. The nerves that come down your spine branch out and connect to various parts of your body. Nerves that come out from here control your bowel and bladder activity and your foot motion and knee flexion. So damage to these nerves would mean that these functions would be uncontrollable. These nerves control your hip motion, your trunk stability and your temperature regulation. The higher an injury occurs in the spinal cord, the greater the loss of function. These nerves control your finger, hand, wrist and elbow movement. Nerves that come out from here control your neck and shoulder movement, your breathing and your heart rate. An injury at this site would result in loss of mobility and sensation to 90% of your body. Spinal cord injury has extremely serious consequences that will affect you for the rest of your life. Currently, there is no cure for spinal cord injury.